What is up guys, Woody LS3 coming at you with another vlog and today guys we're actually going to be going to my buddy Chris's shop. Uh, like I said in the last video we are going to be doing the flex fuel on my extended cab. So for those of y'all that don't remember, these are actually the parts that I got on the last video which is the flex fuel sensor pigtail that goes from the injector to the harness, the actual upgraded fuel injectors, there you go. And then I actually had these adapters. Uh, I actually had these for my uh, for my turbo truck, but Alpha injectors actually hooked me up with the ones from Alpha injectors. So we went ahead and put those on. So I didn't need to use these these other ones. So I, I actually bought these. Now we're gonna actually be able to use them and uh, throw them on my extended cab. But yeah, so that's the parts that I got to make it flex fuel. And uh, like I said, we're gonna go just double check, make sure we have everything we need. I don't like to start a project and then, you know, right in the middle of it, I need something else. So I'm going to go ahead, head up to my buddy Chris's shop real quick. I was going to do it here at the house, uh, which I still am. I'm just probably going to just do whatever, everything that I can here at the house. And then uh, we'll be going over there, possibly taking the ECU to him. That way he can go ahead and put a flash in it. And then we can put a, plug it back in and uh, go ahead and the truck should be good enough to drive over to his shop. And then he'll do his final adjustments over there. So... Right now, I just still want to double check, make sure I have everything I need. So we're going to go get with him real quick. So Ricky, Keep or Ricky, so, bro. What you bring no, that, that right your truck doesn't touch rain. Which one you bring? Nah, uh, my my truck can't get on the dyno. Oh, it melts in the water. So. It melts in the water, yeah. yeah. <laughs> What's I got going over here? Uh, that was much. We gotta change that uh the whole fuse, the main fuse, uh, the mega fuse, mega fuse, mega fuse. Why would you mega mega, mega my ass? Alright, so is the shop officially open? We're shooting for the first next one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We're taking in work already. Damn! You got quite a bit of work here, huh? Yes, as you can see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's a couple parts. Yeah, you got that one on the list. Yeah. Finally. That's part out number one. That's part out number one? <laughs> we're getting it done for sure. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Now we're getting the, the, the air compressor line made. Yeah, well, I see y'all got the floor. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, you got the lift now? You got power to the lift now, right? Yeah. They got power to them? Damn. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so the shop's coming together, guys. It looks really, really good in here. We got the floor done, and uh, yeah. Hopefully, Chris will do some pools in here soon. Well, yours? I don't know. You can well, I have, guys, I haven't took my truck out. He's making fun of my truck because I said if it rains, I don't, I don't bring it out. But yeah, that's why he's telling. What did you say? No, it melts in the water. It melts right? in the water. According to Woody. Yeah, no, I don't uh, take my truck out when it rains, guys. I, I had a bad experience. I mean, I know it's like. Down uh, up the five road, but away. It, yeah, it is five minutes away. But I mean, we'll, we'll bring it in here soon. I still gotta do some. We still gotta change. What else did you wanna do? I think that's it. Spark plugs and something else. I can't remember. Oh yeah, right spark plugs. Which I got them. I found them. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I got the spark plugs. You gotta do spark plugs on that. Uh, I think with turbo trucks, after so many hits, you wanna change the spark plugs again. So I got the spark plugs, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can get this truck on the dyno. That way we can see what we actually made because I still don't know what we made. So. Hopefully it makes some good power. I know Chris has an extended cab here. And uh, here, we're going to check it out real quick. Uh, you just put that one on the dyno, right? Uh, I won't say the numbers, but yeah. it's really good numbers. Uh, that's actually Chris's field. Like, he recommended everything on that truck, you know? 
for it. That's, that's your, that's your baby. The heads, the block, the, the pistons, the cam. Not the turbo. The customer gave me the turbo. Yeah. So, like, you know, this is what I got, and then make a build around it. Alright, so it's actually, it could hold more. It could hold more. Oh, damn. Okay, hell yeah, hell yeah. So, for those of you that don't know, Chris not just tunes, uh, he actually does get off his ass once in a while, and he tunes. And, uh, I can build motors. He, he can build motors, so there you go, guys. If y'all need any motor build, uh, that's actually one of his many builds. I'm giving him a hard time. He knows what he's doing, and uh, yeah, so hopefully we can get my extended cab that fast. Well, no, the single cab. <laughs> the single cab, yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris wants my single cab, and uh, we gotta get the 4x4 on that thing, too. We got the lifts, we I got know. the welder. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. They look identical. Here you go. Let's go take a look at this extended cab real quick. I kind of, I love the wheels, man. I hear a lot. I don't know if I feel in that front bumper, but the wheels are nice. The wheels are nice. The wheels are nice. Damn, look at this, guys. Check this out. I guess they... Borg Warner S480. You know, customer gave me the turbo, and then I did the rest. Okay, so you pretty much put all, you spec'd out the motor and everything like that? The, the, yeah. The, all the parts and the, stuff. The pistons, the rods. The crank, the flywheel, cam parts, and valve train parts. It's got Ferrero valves. You know, a lot of little details went to the motor. Yeah, yeah. So, little details. Like I said, guys, this truck actually made really good power. The customer doesn't want to show uh, what power it made. You know, we got to respect that. So, uh, but yeah, no, guys, this is a pretty cool build. On top of this, it's a 2001 with flex fuel. With flex fuel. That's with, the that's the main thing. With flex fuel, and it worked. That's the thing, guys. A lot of these trucks, uh, older ones, they're either flex fuel or they're 93. There is no, you can go hop back in between the two. So that's why we say flex fuel, you know, because you can take both. Yeah, so this can run on 93 and E85. He can pump whatever he feels like it. But obviously with 93, it's gonna be less power, but it can do it. Yeah, I mean, uh, you sometimes you wanna, you know, switch it out, right? We switch it out just, um, you know, if he's gonna park the truck for a while, go ahead and fill it up with 93 and, you know, let it run for a little while and then turn it off and it'll be good all winter. Saying that's the reason I do the flex fuel sensors. Because, you know, it's it sucks leaving your tank before E85 and you sit there for three or four months. It turns all gunky and gummy. And then your injectors go to trash. Your fuel pump goes to trash. You got to take off your fuel tank, clean it out. It's a lot of work for nothing, just for not putting a flex fuel sensor. Yeah, you know and, and that's a lot of things that people don't know that, right? Yeah. Why not just put the flex fuel sensor, dump out your dump out some E85, top it off with 93, and then just drive it around and park it. That's much know. smarter. So, yeah, guys, this is a nice build, like I said. We've got the new Bullet Specialty wheels all the way around. 20s up front and then 17s up back. Yeah, 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 that's a nice combo, guys. I really like that. Uh, obviously, he's still working on it. It's not done. And but shout out to Velocity. Velocity is the one that got us the wheels and tire package. And he, he, got a, he got them in pretty quickly. He's the one that recommended the tire sizes. And it looks killer. Yeah, that, no, that's a yeah. good tire size for the front, man. I would like something like that. It drives really straight, really smooth. Like, it, it's perfect. You yeah. Know, perfect street strip. You got the best of both worlds for sure. And you can take the family. Yes, yes. <laughs> it has AC heat. Um, remote start is not working right now, but it, it is going to have remote start. You know, I don't know. It has all the creature comfort. We didn't take nothing off. It yeah. No yeah. weight loss, no nothing. Man, that's awesome, guys. That's actually what I want for my extended cab. Obviously, nothing this crazy as far as the turbo. Just a good NA truck. Uh, oh, sorry. They want a supercharged truck. They want me to supercharge that one. So I was thinking maybe an LSA style. Yeah, LSA would be cool. Would be cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So. We're going to do an LSA on that one, and uh, yeah, maybe something like this, maybe a little, what do you think, guys, comment down below, should I go with this wheel setup, or uh, should I stick with the welds, or maybe do some Bogards, so I kind of like the Bogards, bro. Yeah, I, I, my, my favorites is the Bogards, the Billet Specialties, the welds are my third, you know, but the welds are cool. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. yeah. Bogards and Billet Specialty, that's my top two. My, my welds are badass, too. Yeah. So. yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying, there's a lot of cool little welds, but everybody has them. Yeah, nah, yeah it, not, not mine. Not yours, not but, mine. you know... The S71s, that's, you know, yeah, yeah, everybody that, got them. But it, it's a good, it's a good looking wheel, that's yeah, why. Yeah, that's, you know, no yeah. doubt, but like, damn. Yeah, no, no, I, I'm you thinking. Can't, you can't rock the same shoes everybody's rocking. You know what I'm yeah, saying? That's true, that's true. Oh, that's a good point, that's a good point. I do like the Bogarts, and uh, yeah, maybe we'll switch it up. I have done welds on my last two cars. So, yeah, I kind of want something different. So, I don't know, comment down below, some building specialties or some Bogarts. So.